We all right, you right, I right about our memory. We're facing real challenges. Those challenges are making us look like limited human people. So we fail all of the time to recall those uh, crucial informations, very, very basic informations, especially when it comes to the time of exam, maybe, or whenever you wanted to release some speech, some presentation for a group of people. So not performing in a good way in front of others also uh, is a real challenge. So, and every one of us facing those problems, there is no one accepted. But the question is, are we naturally limited in that way? Our memory is limited in that way, or there is something we need to understand. There is something we need to know. That is what I'm going to share with you in this video. If we talk about the structure of our memory, this weight is an average 1400 grams 80% of it consists water that is why the doctors and those physicians are all the time uh, recommending us to drink more water uh, and in recent studies shows our brain contains between 100 to 150 billion neurons each of those neurons makes a more than 60,000 snaps to create memories. So this is a giant system that we have, uh, we as a human, but using of that system is a problem. It is 2% of our body, but when it comes to the consuming of energy, it takes 30% of that energy of your, that you are taking and the 20% of the entire oxygen that you are taking. Pfizer Mark Rosen, the second stress of California University, says that in our human memory, if we store every second 10 information in our, our entire life, entire life, maybe 100 years, 8 years, 60 years, all of those years, if we put 10 information, 10 knowledge every second, in our memory, when we finish in this life, half of our memory is empty. All of those informations can fill half of your memory. That's the truth. That's a fact. But the other fact, we fail to, uh, to recall very basic information, very small amount of information we can't restore. That's also another fact. Uh, he says, the problem of our memory is not, it is physical capability, it's not, it is appealing, but the problem is the mismanagement, the poor management of using it. There are too many thousands of memory champions who memorize a lot of information, who memorize everything, tens of information which are incredible. Uh, if we watch them memorizing those informations, those numbers, abstract numbers, abstract information, names, they're memorizing them in a very short time. He memorized 4,620 digits in one hour, 4,006 hours and 20, 7,485 digits. Also, 30 minutes, 7,485 digits. Numbers which are consist zero one one zero that kind of numbers you know and you can understand how it's difficult. It is very very difficult, isn't it? It is real challenging. No one can memorize something like that. But it's very easy. It's very very simple according to these people, these champions, and they are not abnormal people. They are a people like you, like me, and they are memorizing all of these things. How they do that? That is what I'm going to explain in the video. There is two sides, the right side and the left side. And each side has it is special characteristics, special uh, ways of functioning. So uh, the right side, we use mostly images, creativity, colors, emotions, imaginations, experiments, generalizations. On the left side, we use the language, analyze, one color, logic, repeating, numbers, listing, details. This is a more logic side where we organize, we repeat. When we are repeating, most of the students, 99, 99 of the, uh, those people who are memorizing something, they use the right side of their memory because they are repeating, they are analyzing, they are bullet pointing, 
and that kind of memorizing is using of the right side of your memory but these jambion jambions uh, who have been using their memory in a perfect way, in an incredible way, they never use this side. They have used it, a small portion of it, but the most of the time they are using the right side of the memory, which most of the time understands the image, the creativity, the imagination, the visualization. That kind of uh, full of imagination and creativity is the main power of their memory. That is why they are uh, thousands, seven thousand, six thousand of numbers, abstract numbers, uh, binary numbers, digital numbers. They are memorizing them in 30 minutes, in one hour, in five minutes. If our memory has all of those capabilities, all of that power, why we do forget? I will explain it in the other video. So uh, please stick with me, subscribe to this channel, and also like the video for YouTube algorithm. Thanks for watching. See you soon.